everyone, it's Miranda from Diamond Painting with the Besties. How are you? I hope everyone is doing amazing and you had a fabulous weekend. It's been a minute, hasn't it? Um, just got back from our swim meet trip. Everything was awesome. It's been a little while since I posted a video, but here we are. So if you're new to the channel, welcome. I hope you'll consider subscribing. And if you're not new, well, thank you for coming back. So in front of me, we have a Distracted by Diamonds box. Um, and if you guys have seen them before, you notice that they've been upgraded and they have more of this purple orange ombre effect to them with some pink and, you know, it's nice and shimmery. So this right here is a new release. Uh, one of the newest releases I should say, but with a new artist. And I'm really excited about this because it's one of my favorite, favorite people. It is... Yellow Frida by Caroline Smith. So when I saw this, I was like, oh my God, I have to have this. Um, it's a round, it's a 62 by 88. So she's pretty big. I know uh, my friend Maria and I, anytime there's anything Frida, Kahlo, that we always let each other know. So Maria, I'm letting you know, if you haven't seen this. Yeah, I'm really, really excited about this. I've had it for a minute. But as you guys probably know and have experienced yourself, that everyone is super, super busy. So better late than never, right? So the box is a little beat up, but what do I always say? It doesn't matter what's on the outside, only what's on the inside. So let's see, here's another view of the thumbnail because that plastic probably kind of gave it a little glare. So let's get into this. Can you guys believe it's almost like Christmas time. It's insane, insane. So here we have our canvas in our nice dust bag and, and oh, goodness. Included goodies, your standard diamond painting pen with a thick six placer, the new uh, storage container that doubles as a tray. You can use both the lid and the bottom part. I absolutely love these. A red heart shaped plate of wax and the infamous and new distracted by diamond washi tape which i absolutely love all righty oh okay here we go i like these thicker ones because i tend to not mess up the dust bag and i can put it back in sometimes i like tear them if they're already like um, if they're really thin so these are poured glue. They are the thicker um, oil type canvas, which is one of my favorites. You get a sheet of release paper. Here are our drills right here. We'll go over those a little bit later. Let me just get her kind of situated. I'm probably gonna have to roll this back which you can do because it is poured glue. She's a little, this one's definitely gonna have to rest and that is okay, it's okay, it's okay. Goodness, big, big, big canvas. Oh, bear with me guys, bear with me. All right, so I'm gonna hold on to this, maybe. So, Actually, no, I'm not, because I'm going to unroll this a little bit. You can see we don't have it all in frame, so we're gonna have to take a tour. So now, one of the newest upgrades is this huge sticker sheet, huge. So here is another thumbnail. You can cut that out, put it in your log book. We have our 54 pre-cut labels that you can either attach to the bag or you can, if you don't like working out of the baggies, you can put these on your containers. Um, yep, all 54, there are no ABs in this one, which is okay, you can always add your own if you feel like you need to. And it does say Yellow Frida by Caroline Smith 2021 and then carolinesmithart.com. 
And then, the, of course, is basically uh, the mission statement and what Distracted by Diamond stands for, which I absolutely love as well. All right. Oh, my nose is itchy. All right. Are you guys ready? One, two, oh, three. Oh, my goodness. She is so pretty, holy confetti. I knew it was. I knew it was. I'm okay. I'm okay, you guys. I'm prepared. So at the top, you can see that we have our scalloped edges right here, distracted by diamonds. In the upper right, we have our thumbnail right here with a ginormous legend down the upper right with another legend down here at the lower left. And at the bottom, it says Yellow Frida by Caroline Smith 2021 and then carolinesmithart.com. You guys... Holy cow. I love her skull earrings. That's like one of the first things I noticed. I love the background. Thank God this is around. Oh my. Symbols are super, super clear. Um, now, uh, if your painting isn't laying as flat as you would like, you can pull this plastic oh so gently back. We'll check the sticky. All right, yeah, it's pretty, it's pretty sticky. Yeah. And then what you can do is, I'm going to turn it sideways for a second, is slowly um, guide the plastic down so it will lay a little bit flatter. You know what? She's like totally giving me um, Susie and the Banshee. So Susie Sue from Susie and the Banshee vibes with that look on her face and just the, the shadowy mask going across her eyes. Yeah, I'm getting total Susie and the Banshee vibes. And I'm probably dating myself. So if you guys know who Susie and the Banshees are, uh, let me know in the comments below. I'm just gonna pull this back real quick so we can I can show you the clear symbol clarity. Don't mind my arm in the way. Oh my God, here we go. There we go, sorry. Super clear. I am like so happy and excited like how clear these images are now and the symbols. All right, let me just fold this plastic down a little bit. We've got this you know, butterfly in her hair, this like totally it's like flower and succulent type background going on, but I'm totally drawn to her eyes. Um, I honestly don't think any ABs are actually needed in here. Um, maybe some old gold, but I don't really think I'm gonna mess with it. I think I'm just gonna like leave her as is because it's just got this like very like subtle and ornate look and I don't really wanna do anything to take away. I'm absolutely loving the design on her, her dress or her shirt, her outfit. Um, I think it's absolutely stunning. So I'm excited. I'm interested to see if any more of Caroline Smith's work's going to come out. I haven't gotten a chance to do any research or check out what her other stuff is, but if it's anything like this, I'm probably gonna absolutely love it. I love seeing artists' interpretations of powerful and important um, figures from um, our history. And I think this is absolutely stunning. So let's flip her over real quick. And let's take a look at some of these colors. So there is a combination of some muted tones and some bright, which I absolutely love. We do have some 310 in here. There's some pinks, some yellows, some deeper blues, um, a little bit of purple, a corally pink, skin tone, like a blush and some oranges, but then we've got our really dark colors back here, which are more for the flowers, I think. And then we have some pinks and we have burgundy and a purple. 
and a reddish right here, but nothing too, too bright and flashy. Um, I think we have, that's 550. So the DMC codes are, are on the bags themselves, but you can also stick those labels on there or just dump them into the container. Um, the kit number is listed here on the pack of drills and if you choose to store them separately. Um, let's take one quick look at her again. Um, I'm just totally, oh, I'm just totally in love with this. I'm really excited to see how the blush and how her face turns out, these different hues. I, do, I love the eyes. I, yeah, her face is definitely, and the skull earring is definitely my favorite part. But yeah, this is a confetti. There is some color blocking, so that's good. You know, there's actually quite a bit of color blocking. But then over in the flowers here, we have some confetti. There's confetti in her face like confetti heavy in her face with a tiny bit of color blocking. Um, this, her hair is all color blocking, so that'll be nice. And then, you know, this has got some, so it's a, I'll say that it is a fair amount, you know, it's pretty equal between color blocking and confetti. I will definitely be sectioning this off. All right, you guys, so what do you think? What do you think about Yellow Frida? Leave me a comment. Um, yeah, and I hope you guys, uh, I'm going to let, let you guys go. So we have Yellow Frida. Once again, 54 colors are round. It's a 62 by 88, I believe. Yep, 62 by 88 centimeter. So she is quite large. But yeah, go check out Distracted by Diamonds. Uh, go check out Robin. I'm sure, um, make sure you read the description on her webpage. You know, it is the holiday time. They might be taking a couple days off, but she does put the times that she releases and the days that she releases. Um, and as of right now, so like Wednesdays and Thursdays are her days off. And then she resumes on Friday. But with the holidays coming, you definitely want to go check out Distracted by Dimes. Oh, and it's on Etsy. So I will link the shop down below in the description to give you quick access to get there as well if you've never been there before. All right, you guys. Well, I'm going to get out of here. Thank you for joining me. Um, I'll see you in the next video. Remember, be safe and be kind. Bye. Bye.